Hi there, good afternoon. I'm here from Robin from Mendeley. Robin, uh, why don't you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Robin. Um, I'm the VP of Engineering at Mendeley. I've been at Mendeley about two years now, which is nearly half the lifespan of Mendeley. Mendeley's been going about four years now. Um, so my responsibility is uh, the well-being of the engineering team, which is the software development team. So I'm here really on their behalf to recruit some more people to join us. Thank you. Um, and what is it that Mendeley does? Um, we are working on uh, changing the role of um, infrastructure for research, for research scientists. So there's a lot of money in publishing scientific information, a lot of, a lot of money on the table, and we're looking at taking some of that money and using it to provide tools for scientists. So it's about collecting information that we want to share with other scientists and providing the social network that allows them to meet other people doing similar research. Okay. Um, in, in terms of the engineering department, uh, maybe you could tell us some of the technologies that you are using. So, yes, of course. so the front end of the website is written in PHP. Uh, we're looking for some extra PHP developers to join us. Um, the back end is written in Java uh, with MySQL and a bunch of big data technologies that we're using Hadoop at large scale. We've got uh, 300 million roughly documents in, in storage. So we've got large large problems to solve. Um, and we've also got a desktop application, which is what most of our users use, and that's written in C++ and Qt. Okay, I understand you have a mobile application as well? Yeah, that's outsourced at the moment. It's, it's an iOS application. Um, it's using our open API, and so we're expecting to see more mobile platforms using that API. Mm -hmm. Third parties at the moment are doing Android, other interesting things. Um, we have some kind of longer term plans for bringing that back in-house, but nothing short term. Okay. Um, you mentioned about publishing. Are, are you working with any companies that uh, some of the job seekers might be aware of? Um, yeah, we've got some relationships with, with some of the major publishers. So we, we work with, um, we share documents in a kind of open marketplace. So we will allow other people to give us documents. But among the things we've uploaded, we've uploaded every single document that the IEEE have ever produced. So the Institute of Electronic Engineers. We've got everything they've ever published and we've got a feed from those guys. So we're following their stream. And we've got some relationships with other publishers in the pipeline as well. Okay, that's great. But where do you see Mendeley, say, in three years' time? Um, that's a difficult question to answer because the market's so dynamic. Um, the, the initial focus of the company was very much on the desktop application and helping individual researchers. I suspect in the next, in the longer term, we'll be looking much more at the deeper value we can get out of the data. So it'll be much more about finding research which is interesting because it's been referenced mm -hmm. elsewhere and that kind of effect of having large volumes of data, we start to see some synergy coming out of it. So that back-end services is where I'd see the focus. Okay. If I was a job seeker well, um, and I asked you this question, what would, what would you say why it's great to work for you? As a developer, the biggest thing really is that we're solidly committed to quality, um, so we're not about getting something out of the door rapidly, we're about doing it properly and getting it right, and we spend a lot of effort internally working on process challenges in producing good software. So we're, uh, we're an agile shop, we use XP within the uh, Java team fairly solidly and we're pushing some of that out into other teams. We use um, Scrum as a, as a small small phase project management and we're using Kanban for operational instances. So we've got a, a kind of a suite of different techniques that we use but we're changing things the whole time and, and that kind of uh, introspection on what we're doing is um, what would you say makes your company stand out from your competitors? I think I think the biggest thing is that we have a mission. So we're not out just to make money, we're out to really change an important bit of industry. So when you look at where our science money goes, at the moment a lot of it goes into the pocket of the publishers and not into producing good academic research. And we're about, divert, divert, about uh, disrupting that industry and taking some of the money that they're shoving back out into their pockets and really turning it back into science. So some of the major public funding that's happening in things like the Human Genome Project is really around data sharing and we're providing infrastructure to help with that. Okay. So it's, it's a company with a real purpose rather than just making money. Okay. Uh, we want to thank you for being present at the Tech Startups Job Fair today. Okay. Is there anything that you're looking for particularly from this experience? Um, really 
it's, a, it's an opportunity to have direct contact with the developers and to explain to them what it is we're trying to do um, and to get them on board with us. You know, we're keen to, to build people and grow people and we've, we've had some, uh, some interesting people work with us and we'd just like to continue that process. We, we've got a huge amount of data, a lot of software that we're writing. So it's an interesting challenge. That's great. Some people on board. That's great. Thank you very much, Ryan. Thank you.